mm. I don't know, say to say to say two hundred and fifty thousand of them are like two hundred and fifty million are thinking, oh yeah, we we definitely want five D now, yeah, and then you've got one hundred and fifty million who go, well, I don't know, we're not we're not I don't know, the buyer might get into power, it might go south, and things are just going to go pear shaped, and there's this battle between you two, and yeah. sometimes there's more more people thinking this way because your you know your mind your mindset changes your vibration changes from minute to minute day to day hour to hour week to week month to month it changes a lot at the moment one minute you're all in your love and your light and the joy and next minute you've been hit with some past ancestral healing that you need to do and you're like god damn it i was loving my life right until my mum decided to appear and I need to go and heal that stuff, you know? So your vibration just drops a little bit. So you can see the masses is like changing continuously. It's always in flux. And so when many of you have done the healing, when many of you are awakened, that's when you will see some stability. And I think in 2021, we're gonna see more stability. If we weren't going to see more stability, I would not be told I can take time off. So for this whole year, I've not had any time off. It's been on, 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 on. There are weeks, Jackie, where I thought, oh, my God, I've got to connect with seven people this week. I've got to have seven video chats. How am I going to do that? You know, I feel really tired. But there's always something within me that does it. But, uh, but I've never, in that one point, I've never been, in, that, in this year, there's never been a moment where I thought, right, you know, I need to take a break. Only now, when we're reaching the end of this year, the end of this cycle, we are um, getting the opportunity now to take a break, which means there's a bit of a breather coming up, which means we're going to see some stability in the vibration, which is That's great. It's encouraging. It is encouraging. Yes. It is. You, you'll find many of you will be doing this, taking some time out. Yes. Because you're all amazing. How many of you have been doing the healing? Not just healing your own 3D experience, but ancestral healing, healing your mom, your dad, you know, your children, you know, your husband, your wife, the cat, the dog, you know, all of them. <laughs> yeah. Um, we just, yeah. we have, yes, we have to stay in our light and our love and shine our light brightly for yeah really really powerfully for the next two three months mm. and then i think maybe i hope maybe it'll settle a little could somebody maybe. shine a light on the freaking internet for <laughs> yeah <me>, you please <laughs> oh yeah it's sorry ha- girl it's, it's happening it's happening there's more awakened now than ever i feel it in the one consciousness mm-hmm. Let me describe it to you so it helps you guys. There's a realization. This is what I'm feeling. A realization amongst quite a lot of the masses right now. The deception is difficult to deal with. It's not easy knowing that they have been deceived. And so many are going through this right now. And dealing with it. And also, at the same time, trying to deal with this conspiracy theories that are coming up, almost in shock that this could actually be happening. And I think, yeah, they feel a little bit disillusioned in many ways because they've been fooled. No one likes to be fooled and deceived in this way. And um, questions are being asked. But it's... um, but many are still still plugged in. So on one hand, they're receiving information that, you know, this is deception going on where the governments have been, where our leaders have been treating us, COVID-19, vaccines, da 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 And then on the other hand, you know, um, there's also this realisation that um, they did not just come here for a 3D existence. You came here for more. And this is the transition we're making. Now, over the last 100, 200 years, you came here for a 3D experience. This is exactly what it was about. And the reason the reason why that came about is because you are actually now 
moving towards a different vibration and in order to move to a different vibration you, you actually have to be that vibration and this is the transition you're seeing right now no longer are the 3d things important anymore no longer is you know your money three things money status power they're not important to you anymore and we're moving away from that what is important is connection what is important is love what, what is important is vibration well, this, this, these are the things that are important to you. Joy, being joyful in what you're doing, discovering parts of yourself that had been forgotten for such a long time. How many of you are creative right now using art, dance, singing, you know, crystals? These are so many ways you are expressing the vibration within you to the whole world. This is what it's about. You, you are sharing your vibration with one another. This is exactly what it needs to be. And it's so beautiful for someone like me to watch it. It's such a gift. It really, really is. This transition period is such a beautiful thing for many of us to watch and be a part of and be here with you, doing this with you. You're going to look back at this. I can see it now, every single one of you. You're going to look back at this and go, oh, my God. Oh, my Lord. Did we really did we do that? Did we really do that? Did we move from this heavy 3D dense reality and ramped it up to 5D? How extraordinary are we? And this is going to be like a, you know, you're creating a photo album book. This is what you're doing right now. This is the best way I can describe it. You're creating memories right now. You're creating memories through vibration. And at one time, you're going to look back on this experience and you're going to go, I was there. I was there during that time. I was there. And I will share with you what that feels like. This is why you're connected to your galactics right now. The ones that can't be here, who have chosen not to be here to support you with your 3D experience. You're going to be able to be in front of them and share that vibration with them and say, I will share with you what it was like on planet Earth. This is what happened. I was a part of this. Do you see? I do. I do. It's 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 a big happening. It's really yeah. much will be learned. People will learn a lot, mm -hmm. and hopefully, they will ascend. Yes. So, There's no hoping about it, Jackie. Use your words. No, well, we're not hoping. We're going. They will do it. <laughs> they will do it. Thank you. <laughs> I did not come all this way <laughs> for us to give up right now. No, God damn. No, we're not doing that. <laughs> we're going there. <laughs> and even if that means I have to drag 8 billion of you over there, we're going. <laughs> what, can I ask a question about the 21st? Because there's all these messages out there. Yeah, you have to choose between these three Earths and all the, I mean, I'm reading all these things and all these messages and you know i in my heart know what what's that if you don't have to choose earths and neutral earths the 3d earth or the fifth, the, fifth the, you know, the, the five i just think it's so it's so confusing for for people that are just just waking up that there's so many different mixed messages out there or then there's one that 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 you know the apocalypse the apocalypse is coming i mean there's just the awful okay let's let's backtrack a little bit okay so how many of you have actually you know over 2020 um, gone through many celestial light changes so what i'm talking about is moons super moon red moon blue moon wolf moon how many of you have experienced changes during those times i think pretty much all of us have all been through that there's been many haven't there mm -hmm. solar eclipses there's been many right there's made been many of them yes right okay so this is no different <laughs> I just think sometimes you guys hype up quite a lot, you know. Yeah. Sometimes it's a bit like celebrities, you know. Saturn and, and Jupiter are coming into alignment. Now, yes, they are correct. It has not happened for a long time. 
700, 700 years might seem a long time for many of you, but the reality is, is still in the blink of an eye for many of us, you know? So please use your own discernment. There is so much out there um, that people are saying, you know, the spiritual world is saturated with a lot of opinions about it. The, the, the conjunction of those two pretty pretty impressive planets is very important it's not to say that it's not anything that happens in the celestials and what i mean by celestials i mean planetary okay in this particular solar system anything that happens is very very important everything's been set up to help you with the vibration so each one of you would have agreed to come more into your vibration or to be awakened during this particular time you all set your agreements there are four i've already mentioned them already on, uh, on another video, okay? So um, some of you might experience it earlier, yes? And some of you might experience it later. So when you guys are talking about the 21st, like I'm going through it right now, and we're nowhere near the 21st, are we? Yeah. <laughs> we're, like, we're like a good week and a half away from it, right? <clears throat> but I'm experiencing it right now. So what I can tell you what I'm experiencing is I feel very dizzy. I feel very lightheaded. I'm feeling like um, I'm feeling like this vibration changes in me. It's very, very strong at the moment. Um, there are certain foods that I just can't eat. Sometimes I'm not eating at all at the moment, and I'm just drinking plenty of water. And um, and I really have no care for the 3D things at the moment. I really, in fact, I find it irritating at the moment. I really don't want to deal with any of the 3D stuff. And um, when this is over for me, um, I'm definitely being kind of guided to kind of take a break from it. This is how I feel. So the changes are already happening. It just depends on your particular experience, on your vibration and when you want to experience it. Some of you experience it early. Some of it you will experience it later. Some of you experience it a year later. I know some of the stuff that I've been through this year. I know other high vibrational beings experienced it two years before I did. Yeah, you're so hooked on linear time and on dates. Stop. Vibration is the key. I keep repeating myself. I feel like a broken record. Vibration is the key. <laughs> Whatever your vibration needs right here, right now, that's what it needs. Own it. Go with it. Stop comparing yourself with others. Oh, my God. Yeah. Like these people, like, you, you know, other people are like, well, they're collecting, they're connecting the galactics and oh my god they're doing all this ancestral healing and you know um they know who they are you know they're fully aware of that vibration and and i'm you know many of you will be like well i don't even know who i am I, i'm just started on this path i can't even meditate for two minutes and yet this person that i'm you know is just doing this amazing stuff stop comparing yourself didn't i just say that no two vibrations are the same you're unique so why would you connect? Why would you why would you compare yourself? You're unique. You can't compare uniqueness. You can't compare that. Why are you doing that? Stop it. Own who you are. Own who you are. You're beautiful just the way you are. Your vibration is beautiful just the way you are. Bring your magic. Bring it. I want to see it. Bring it. Bring your magic. Show the world. Show the world your magic, because I'm telling you now, it's a wonder to behold. Mm. It's a wonder for each and every one of you. You might see the lack within you. Mm. You might see you're not enough. You might say, I don't love enough. I don't have enough in my heart. I'm not high vibration enough. I don't see that. I don't see this. I just see the uniqueness of each and every one of you. And you know what? Just the way Father sees this, you are beautiful. Just the way you are. No changes. Just the way you are. So bring it. Bring your magic. Let's see it. Because I know you can. Does that make sense? Am I making any sense? Yes. yes. <laughs> Perfect sense. Good. Don't compare. If the date's going to be, the date will be, you know, whatever the date will be, will be. If you want it to be that date, guess what? 
that's what you're creating. It's going to be that day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If you want it to be all singing, dancing, whistles and bells, you're going to get it. Because the manifestation at the moment is like this. It's quick. Yes. If it's just going to be, well, it's just going to be another day. Guess what? It's just going to be another day. But Gaia is taking you with her. Like, don't, don't, don't think she's not. She's taking you. Dragging, kicking, screaming, she's taking you. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Oh, my God. I'm looking forward to it. But you talk about dizzy. I've been dizzy a lot. Yeah. Yes. We're yes. getting ready. We're getting ready. I'm almost done with mine. I wanted. I want to be done with it. Yeah. So I can take. That's so I can take January off. That's my aim to take it off. Yeah. So yeah. I hope that answers your question. Does it answer your question, Deb? So um, it does. does. Okay. Beautifully. Wonderful. Okay, I know you guys have got other questions, but can we do quite and, a um, end because, she's, because I got booted. Um, yeah. I, I yes, but I was gonna, I was going to say that I I can't see the questions anyway because I have whiplash from being booted out of the room so many times. Oh. Um, and Wendy, you you've um you've gotten all of this recorded, correct? Wendy. Uh. No, not all of it. It seems that there was the part of it that was supposed to be not shared with people. The connection with Source, um, Tamara's experience, yeah. Tamara's experience was not on. So apparently I didn't realize I wasn't recording. And thank goodness somebody pointed that out to me, dear Phil, <laughs> keeping me on the uh, straight up and up. So when I got it was right about, um, it was right about, about when he was talking, uh, Jackie. Jackie had asked a question, and Nalish was like, he was like telling us, giving us some news, like telling us what needed to be done. So I got the good stuff. Okay. So yeah. I'm, I apologize. I was like, oh no. Okay. So well, it's, we're gonna it's have meant to be exactly what it's meant to be. That's fine. It's meant to be exactly what it's meant to be. Some things are to be shared, and some things are just between us. So uh, I'm saying, goodness, we have somebody that knows how to edit videos. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay let's a, do this, shall we? Shall we do it? Sorry, go on, Deb. I was interrupting okay. you. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Kuan Yin's very excited. <laughs> okay, let me just... <clears throat> I just want to see each and every one of your faces. Hey, Raf. Tove is here, okay. Wonderful. Enid has joined as well. Wonderful. Okay. Good. Wonderful. David Florence is here. Wonderful. Okay, good. Now I've seen each and every one of your faces. That's beautiful. Okay, so let me share this story with you so you know where it's coming from. <clears throat> Kuan Yin came to me a couple of days ago. I don't remember the exact day. I certainly don't re remember the exact time. I just know she turned up. Not very often, you know, ascending masters kind of turn up with me. There's only, there's only two that I tend to have a lot to do with and they, that will be Yeshua and it'll be St. Germain. So, excuse me. Um, so Kuan Yin turns up and she says to me, you're, do, you're doing this, you know, Deb healing thing on Saturday. I want you to, I want you to make this known like, to, to the ones that attend, but also the world. And I'm like, oh, this is exciting. And so she was showing me. So when Kuan Yin has been here on planet Earth and she has many incarnations, um, not that she's sharing that with me, but that's the vibration that she's conveying to me. Because that's how we talk. We don't talk words. We talk in vibration. Okay. So she's so clever. Like she is so clever. This is oh, what she did. She's a good one. Yeah. This is what she did. What she did was um, she imbued some of her energy um, into um, the core of Gaia. And so what she showed me was um, she exposed this energy. 
And all, all I could see was I'm standing on planet Earth as we are right now. And um, suddenly this crack like opens up from Gaia. And all I see is this incredible bright white light emanating from it. It is phenomenal. I don't know if you can feel the goosebumps right now, but I can feel it. It's like this beautiful bright white just emanates from this crack. And I'm like, well, oh, what's this then, Kuan Yin? She goes, this is my energy. And I want you to share this with those in this group, but it's also going to be shared across the world. So how this energy is going to be transferred is through the soles of your feet. OK, so I want you to put your feet on the floor if you can. If you can't, don't worry about it. And what are you going to feel is a lot like a slight tingling, tickling sensation on the bottom of your foot. So if you're ticklish, I'm sorry, but that's what <laughs> she's saying. Okay. You're, going to, you're going to feel it. This tickling, oh, yeah. this tingling, tickling sensation, almost like someone's got like a feather at the end of your feet and tickling you. Right. This is what you're going to feel. She wants what she's saying. What, what she's saying to me is this is the time for her to share this vibration. The current vibration right now on the planet and the current awakening right now on the planet is perfect for her to, to share this with right here, right now. And the reason she's sharing it now is because this is the time or this is the vibration that it needs to be shared. And she wants to share the pureness of her vibration. This is what her vibration feels like. So <clears throat> you're only going to feel it, right, if you're... What are the three things I bang on about? Open, allow, and surrender. So I need you to do all these three things. This is a gift. Okay. <laughs> Let's be open. Be present right now. Be with me in this moment right now to feel this wonderful gift that's been given to planet Earth by Kuan Yin. She is an incredible, remarkable vibration to me. She is so, so powerful. I love the way she does things. And I love the fact that she was so clever that at some point in Earth's history, she imbued her vibration into Earth, knowing that this time would come. How incredible is that? And today she's going to share that with you. She's sharing it with the whole planet. So it's going to come up. OK, so what I want you guys to do is close your eyes like we always do. In through the mouth, in through the nose, out through the mouth. I want you to do that a good few times. I want you to do it seven or eight times. And I just want you to be here with me. Kuan Yin is here with me in this time, dimension, space and reality. And particularly in this vibration. This is the right vibration right now for her to give you this gift. Okay. Good. I want you to be open and I want you to allow and I want you to surrender to this. Give your whole being to this vibration. Give your whole heart to this vibration. It will change whatever you need to change. You will get whatever you need to get from it. Be here right now in this moment. This is a gift and it's a beautiful gift. Good. I can feel many of you letting go and allowing yourself to be feet on the floor. Imagine your feet are on the floor. You're not wearing any footwear. You're not wearing any socks. I want you to imagine yourself standing on planet Earth. It can be wherever you want it to be. I want you to see yourself standing on, on what looks like dirt, mud. You've got bare feet on planet Earth right here, right now. All you can see around you is just mud. It's dry. It feels warm to your feet. And you can feel a rumbling in the soles of your feet. There's a vibration in the soles of your feet. And it's vibrating all the way up through your body. Good right before you, right now, underneath the soles of your feet, a small crack of earth appears, small enough for you to still stand over it. 
And when you look down, you see this incredible bright white tinged with blue light. It's so powerful. You can feel the roots emanating from this light. It connects and tickles your feet and it connects to the root of the soles and your feet and they're both intertwined. You can feel this vibration. It feels palpable. It feels powerful. You can feel it coming up through the soles of your feet. This beautiful, bright, white light coming up through your calves, your ankles. You can feel it coming up through your knees. Feel it coming up through your thighs. This beautiful white tinge with blue light that's from Kuan Yin is penetrating every essence of your being, every essence of your body, every cell, every muscle, every tissue is being bathed in this beautiful light. It's coming up through your thighs, slowly penetrating every aspect of your 3D body. It's coming up through your hips, is activating your chakras as it goes past each and every one. Your, your root chakra is coming up to that, activating it, turning it into a beautiful bright white light, spinning in a clockwise direction, activating you, coming up to your sacral, just below your belly button, Again, spinning it in a clockwise direction, as fast as it can go, a beautiful bright white tinged with blue light above the belly button, the solar plexus chakra. You can feel that spinning right now. Family love is connecting to all that's family to you. 3D galactic universal connecting you to all of that. Good, penetrating your ribs your lungs, now coming to the center of who you are. This is the essence of who you are, your heart chakra. Allow it, open it, accept Kuan Yin's gift, accept that she did this for you and only for you, spinning your heart chakra in a clockwise direction as fast as it can go bringing in that life force energy that Kuan Yin has left for you, allowing it to meld with your vibration, allow it in, surrender to it, be at one with it. Good, take it in, there's an abundance. It never runs out. Your heart chakra is spinning so fast right now. You are feeling so loved, so adored. You are perfect in every single way. Accept this about you. Good. Good. The light is going further up, heading up the chest. Now it's heading up to the top of your shoulders. It's gone through your arms, your fingers, your hands, your elbows. Every part of your being has been penetrated by this beautiful white light tinged with blue your throat chakra right now allows you to speak this vibration it allows you to be at one with this vibration your throat chakra right now is turning into a white beautiful light tinged with blue it is spinning in a clockwise direction as fast as it can go incredible speed it can go opening up all aspects of you to be able to speak your truth, be your truth, to speak your vibration, because your vibration is unique to you, and you now can speak Kuan Yin's vibration. She is talking to you right now, communicating exactly what it is that you need to hear, that you need to feel good. This vibration is heading up through the base of your neck, 
to the middle of your neck, to the top of your neck, through your chin, through your lips, your ears, your cheeks, your nose, your eyes, down into your forehead, in between your eyebrows, your third eye, the power source of all your knowing, of all your awareness, for your connection to all of the beings that you've been connected with, have always been connected with. This now is a beautiful, bright, white light tinged with a light blue spinning in a clockwise direction, spinning as fast as it can, bringing in your awareness, bringing in your knowing, bringing in the exact essence of who you are, making you aware of your vibration, of the being that you are, your mission, your purpose, your galactic family connecting with you. Good. Bring your eyes in, focus to the center between your eyebrows. You will feel it connect to the center of your brain. The pineal gland, which is exactly where it needs to be. Wonderful. I can see you all doing this. Beautiful. Good. The vibration moves on. Bottom of your forehead. Now to the middle. Now to the top. Now to the top of your head, the crown chakra. This crown chakra changes color into a bright, white, beautiful light tinge with blue spinning in a clockwise direction, connecting you to source, to the universe, connecting you to all that is. I want you to see this crown chakra spinning as fast as you can, as fast as possible, bringing in light source energy bringing in the galactic energy bringing in energy from your planets from your knowing from your awareness from all your universes from every single one that you've been to had connection with with every being with every vibration allow that to be known to you now good Allow that information, surrender to it. This is who you are. This is who you've always been. Accept it. Be at one with it. Wonderful. Kuan Yin's going to stand in front of each and every one of you right now. I'm going to bless you right now. From heart to heart. Going to give you the blessing for sharing this vibration, for being here right now, for sharing this beautiful vibration that she's held in stasis just for you. This is all for you. Good. She's loving you. She's blessing you. She is sharing symbols with you. She's writing symbols right now in front of you and imbuing this into your vibration. Giving with love, nothing but love, this is all it is. She honors you just like you honor her, the taking on this vibration. She honors a soul before her, and you honor her by the vibration that you have just assimilated. Wonderful. Show your gratitude, show your love for her. Good. Good. Allow yourself to settle with the vibration. Allow it to settle within your being, within your 3D body, within your emotional body, within your spiritual body. Good. Wonderful. Good. Thank you, Kuan Yin. I want you to bring your awareness back to your surroundings. I want you to bring your awareness back to your body. You can feel the light penetrating through your eyelids right now. And I want you to be here with me now.
Good. Wonderful. Well done, each and every one of you. You were beautiful with it. You're so, this is, you know, it always amazes me. Each time we do these videos, it always astounds me so much how incredibly accepting each and every one of you are. Do you see how incredible that is? How incredible open you are to this vibration. How you just kind of put your heart out there and just like, work your magic and do your jam and just like kill it you guys are just so 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 incredible i am feeling so much love for you guys right now doing this this is so so amazing i adore you i adore you i love the way you do this i love the way you do it it is incredible to me it is incredible i wish for a moment you could see yourself through my eyes just for a moment and you would have no doubt whatsoever how incredibly extraordinary, amazing vibrational souls you are, how unique you are, how each individually you bring your amazingness forward. These are not just words. They are said with love, with vibration. You can feel the vibration in my words. Beautiful. It's always a joy with you guys. You guys amaze me. You really do. You're incredible. Thank you. Thank you so much. Always in awe. Always. Always in awe. Thank you. Thank you, Kuan Yin. That was an amazing meditation. I'm so glad you brought that forward. To be shared with the world, I feel. Okay, beautiful people. It was fun. I enjoyed this ride. <laughs> We're probably not going to see each other before Christmas. There are some with some of you I do connect with and some of you I don't. Have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. Have a fantastic new year. 2021 is going to be incredible. We are all here together. I'm with you. Many of the Ascended Masters are here with us. Father is still here with us. And 2021 is going to be even more incredible than this year. Better. Much, much better. A lot more settled, for sure. So have a great Christmas. Have a great New Year. And I will see you all in February. I'm not going to see you in Jan. I've got some um, time to myself. So I will see you all in February. I love you guys. You guys are incredible. Never forget it. Never forget how much Kuan Yin loves you. She set this. A long time ago for you. She set this for you. She did this knowing in, in anticipation that this moment was going to arrive and this moment's arrived right now. Father shares his energy with you every day, shares his love with you every day. Connect to him. This is the way it is. Okay. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Love, love you. you. Love you guys. Love to everybody. Merry Christmas. Thank Happy you. holidays. Happy New Year. Happy holidays. Love you. Thank you. Enjoy.